I've been bitching and complaining about things this week. The weather and the winds, the bugs. Um, but here's the progress. Let's look on the bright side. Um, these, I'm really just getting supplies, uh, materials and, you know, getting it all together. It doesn't look like much more than a construction site. And I know that these pallets look really fucking janky, but you'll see, it'll work. Um, so this week, yesterday, as a matter of fact, I just got in um, and cut this door in the... aren't flying and burning the hell out of me but still slow going for sure uh, don't be fooled there's a lot of videos telling you about these container homes and you know they may be wonderful but they're not easy I just went through six angle grinder blades and uh, I don't know how many five Something like that five or six uh, sawzall blades going through this and I got I got that much done I'm three quarters of the way through and then I just ran out of blades this shit's hard container the other one's still closed up um 
and this is going to be uh, a bathroom. So this will be like the shower, toilet area, all that. And then there'll be like a wall. And then this will be, that's, these two doors will open up, right? And um, that's gonna be a sliding glass door and that's gonna be my bedroom. So um, I'm gonna have a view of these double doors open and that's to the north. And I cleared all that. So it's just kind of open field and a great vista. And then this is gonna have a big old window cut in it. So <clears throat> from my bed, I'll have a view of that and a view of that and then beyond. All right, so that happened. That's part of it. And then today, what I'm gonna do is um, I got this door from Habitat for Humanity. That's my go-to place. Um, gonna hang the door today. And then um, the last bit of progress really is a lot uh, and this was the, hard one, the hardest thing this week was to um, take a lot of the plantings, the fruit trees and things that I had really um, hoped I could just like make into an orchard straight away. But the desert has other um, ideas and the bugs especially were just eating all of my trees. They still are. Here's my apple tree and I don't know if you can see the leaves. I've got them under mosquito netting to protect them but see like that. Those are bees. They just munch. They eat the plants. They don't pollinate these bees. They, 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 they destroy. <laughs> and they're, they're just relentless. So I had to take my trees, move them inside, and um, hopefully rehabilitate them from all of that. So that's been going on this week as well. And I'm learning. You know, it's, it's not easy to garden out here in the desert, but I'm uh, certainly going to try. This is my other apple tree. See, same thing. So I had to bring her inside. And then my, uh, my uh, peach tree is just... Uh, she's on her last legs already, so I'm trying to rehabilitate her. And Yeah, we'll see. But the vegetables are doing good. And all of my container plants here. So... This greenhouse protection is working. All right, door is framed. It is framed.